<sighs> the saw. Yes. Oh, what can I get rid of? It only takes. It only Hey guys, this is the Dark Preacher, and welcome back to Unturned Milton State. I have a dilemma. I don't know what to get rid of. Uh, you know what? Let's just uh, eat these eggs. It helps uh, increase your food and your hydration, so. But yeah. I don't know what to get rid of because I found a fire axe. Got back down the hill into town. Killed a bunch of zombies on the way in. And... Yeah. Got a fire axe. I'm so happy now. This black sedan is completely out of fuel. So that's pretty much a waste, but... It looks like a good portion of the loot has respawned in town. So I can go around and get some more food and water and such. Be on the lookout for other things like saws. Since I've got the fire axe already. Gotcha. Now, check this out. That zombie heard me, right? Heard the shot. Came toward the noise. Stops it right where I left. There we go. If they're within hearing distance, most of the time they will head right for the noise. So if they hear you, they're going to come get you. <sighs> well, I've got food, I've got drink. I need another vehicle. So let's go back to that bridge. What's this? Oh, it's an ace clip. Uh, an ace is a type of uh, weapon. It's a six-shooter pistol, so it's kind of like a 457 Magnum. But this, oh, this thing, the Heartbreaker, that's my baby. Takes military clips. All right, let's get back to this bridge where last time. <laughs> we got startled by Orange Dude. And, uh, let's cross the river. Let's see what's on the other side. Still haven't found a saw or a GPS or anything like that, so. And it takes a while to get across a map this large. See, achievement unlocked. Hiking. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, let's clear out these zombies from a distance. Right on the head, right about there. And then, his little friend, too. Alright, we got the yellow sedan. Speaking of the ace, there it is. Uh, we don't need that. It's taking up space. Okay. But now I've got a Colt and I've got an Ace. I'm pretty much loaded up for Bear now. Boop. Swim across here. We will go and uh, find ourselves a nice little place to call home. Target. 
He lost interest for a second, causing me to miss. And chat. See, I've been playing this game long enough. I'm really good at headshots. All right, what we got? What we got? What can we move around to get this? You know what? We're a little hungry. And let's see, that made a little bit of room. But we need to figure out. Let's see here. That can go there. That can go there. And then this. Go down there. That can go there. That can go there. And then... Since I've got two of them, I can scrap one for metal, which takes up less space. But yeah, I think what I'm going to do is, so I'm going to head down this road, and if I, I come across anything interesting, I'll bring you guys back. So, see you in a minute. All right, guys, back. Found another town. Yeah. Took a bit to get here, but side road here. I think that leads down to a campsite. There's enough campsites except for a little bit of food, possibly an axe. Now what I'm looking for is a saw and a good spot to set up shop. Let's see if I can kill these zombies from a distance without having to deal with them too much. Headshot. And headshot. No one else? Good to go. Pharmacists. They always drop good loot. Painkillers, bandages. Pharmacies are always good for medicine and cloth. And pow. Yeah, no, no one else here. Oh, look, see, see, and two, simple as that. I've got a few spare clips, uh, granola bar, oh, my space. Yeah, lots of good loot in this town, but I don't have enough space to carry anything with me. Currently, and what I'm looking for is a saw. I need a handsaw. I need a handsaw like it's my job. Ow. Okay. <sighs> let's see. Bank won't have one. Mechanic might. Yeah, let's see here. Let's see. Gotcha. And your little friend, too. Yeah, another thing a mechanic has is a car lift, two road flares. That's not helpful. All right, and farewell, chef. Getting a little low on the ammo in the rifle, but it's all worth it. Now, a good place to find a backpack early on for when you're first starting out is usually schools. You can usually find a backpack in a school. Don't do anything for me. Thank you. At the very least, I can rip up the dang thing for some cloth, but that's about it. 
Hammer, that's not helpful. I already got a hammer. As far as I can tell, a hammer is just a melee weapon. So let's see here. Uh, juice box? No. Uh, what do I need? Do a drink. Drink? Drink. Do I have any drinks on me? I don't have anything to drink on me. Well, that's bad. Switch out that for that. And I'll just drink it right now. Because schools are another source of food and drink. I already got a bedroll, so let us craft that. Pick up that grape juice. Get some apple juice. Yeah. Inventory management is a pain early game. Yeah. Oh look. Yeah, it's a day pack. What'd you drop? Juice box. You almost never, ever, and I mean ever, find what you're looking for immediately. Uh, let's see, what do we got? What can I get rid of? You know what, let's just eat that. That helps. Pick up a bottle of water. I mean, look at this. Food galore. No space for it. I mean, we've got a mechanic, we've got a botanist, we've got a bank, we've got a pharmacy, two story house. A flashlight. I mean, I'm not seeing anything. Reload. Got the magazine? No, I did not. Good. Gotta make sure you hang on to your magazines. take out quite a few zombies before I start running out of ammo. Uh, that's mechanic top. I need a saw. Hmm. Nope. I've already been in here. hard to find some things. Finding a vehicle with, you know, a decent amount of fuel in it. That's hard. Finding a handsaw. Even harder. I can find food. I can find water. I can find things to drink. And for some reason... Handsaw is just escaping me on this map. Now on the official maps like Washington and uh, PEI, I have definitely found a handsaw before. Well, I guess the only thing left to do is to go out of town, 
check other places. So, um, I'm going to probably go check out that campground, and I'll be back with you in just a second, guys. Well, I'm at the campsite. Um, uh, Swiss knife? No, I don't think that. I want that. Ooh, what is this? Fishing rod. Uh, why don't I? Uh, I don't have the space for a fishing rod. Um, what to get rid of? It's starting to get dark. Uh, let me see here. Uh, let's eat a candy bar. And then we'll move this glue up and take this fishing rod. Turn our light on. What we got down here? Cooler. Boat. Boat. What's on the other table here? <gasps> the saw. Yes. Oh, what can I get rid of? It only takes it only takes two spaces. Um 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 fricker. You know what? I don't need those. Um, 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 what else to get rid of? Oh, I've got so much good stuff. You know what? I can find more glue later. Um, put that there. And a saw. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And I make it through the night and find a place to live. Oh, that makes me so happy. You have no idea. I have uh, I have literally spent at least two or three hours before playing this looking for a saw. Just a saw. Plain old hand saw. So I can make planks. So I can make storage crates. So I can put things up. All right, seeing as how it's dark and we are in a spot where there's no zombies, I'm thinking, start looking through our skills here. Now what we want to start out with is crafting. 20, 50, 80, max level on crafting. 20... Don't have enough to get that. So we'll go through and we'll get the lowest costing ones. Uh, yeah, bump that up too. And we've only got 30 left, so uh, less fall damage is good. Immunity is always good. That's good, and we're out. Awesome. Now in this, you can start out your character with a certain job class. Me, I went with Special Forces. Which means it costs less for certain skills to be bought. Before the sun went down, I saw something over it this way. It was yellow. And rather tall. I'm not sure what it was. Yeah, it was straight this way. Oh. That's it. What is that? Is that the... I don't know what this is. I haven't run across this before. Whatever it is, it's very well defended. Looks like a train station. Oh, it is a train station. Okay, cool. Oh, the construction helmet. 
Um, 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 what can I drop temporarily? So I can pick, you know what? Just drop that. Put that on. Just drop that for right now. That for right now. Put that over. Drop the chemicals. Drop that for right now. We'll take that off for a moment. Uh, no. 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 I guess I don't have that recipe unlocked yet. Uh, let me see here. Hel helmet. Oh, come on now. There was a way to craft together. Hmm. <sighs> There was a way to craft together a construction helmet with a flashlight. Well, forget that then. And then, let's see, chemicals, apple juice, glue, twenty dollar note. And see you, buddy. And bloop. Oh, you dropped metal scrap. Look at that. And bloop. Another construction helmet. Got some nails, uh, some wire. We need the experience anyway, so coming up in here and killing those guys is a very good thing. Because that means we can go in here, go in here. That's uh, only nine. Need to kill more zombies. Or chop down a bunch of trees. Could do that. You know, start building up a house. Just drop everything on the ground. Hmm. Now, does that lead back toward that little town? What are... Oh, you're just a little bit of debris. This is a very large map. It takes a long time to get across it. I haven't even gotten to the point where I can find like a GPS unit or a map or anything like that. So I can tell where I am. Never followed train tracks before. Anyway. Uh, I'm going to take a moment, check the time on this episode, and... We'll get back to you in just a second. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, check the time. And uh, yeah, we're out of an episode already. So, uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!